I want to speak about praying for the dead. We have to know that the Bible does not permit praying for the dead. There is no such thing as purgatory or anything like that. Praying for the dead is a pagan tradition. It has nothing to do with Christianity or anything with the Bible. It is wrong. Let's go to Hebrews chapter 9 verse 27. To the left is the King James Version. To the right is the Expanded Bible. And as it is appointed unto men once to die, but after this, the judgment. So what is that saying there? Once you die, that is it. No more prayers. Once a person dies, your prayers cannot help them at all. The way that they lived their life while they were living on earth is going to determine where they are going to go. So if you want to pray for anyone, it is best to pray for them while they are alive now. Don't wait until they die. That is that is not smart. If you want to pray for someone, pray for the living. Let me say this. I believe this too. If you continue to pray for a dead person, I believe, I truly believe that you are going to attract demonic spirits. Anytime when you are doing something that is outside of God, you are going to get something that is outside of God as well. Demons. So this pagan tradition where you are praying for the dead and praying for your ancestors and stuff like that, you need to stop that because you are bringing more trouble upon yourself than what you are willing to go through. Even with witches, and stuff like that they believe they know what they are doing but in the end they find out that more bad things are happening to them than what is good or as they see is good so I pray that this makes sense stop praying for the dead pray for yourself and pray for the living not the dead that is pagan you are going to attract demonic spirits. I pray that this makes sense. There is no purgatory. You only have one chance to get things right. If you choose to mess around and stay in sin and stuff like that, it is too late. So I pray that this makes sense. God bless.